morning, you guys. So today, um, I have a few things that I have to get done. Uh, one of them is a meeting with Amazon to see about my journal, being able to sell it on Amazon. So that's a really big deal. It's really exciting. Um, I ordered these specialty cookies by, it's cookies with a K, um, and they only launch them once in a while. And when they do, they sell out like instantly. I went on as soon as the launch was and the cookies I picked when I went to pay, some of them were already sold. So only got three of these cookies and I'm so excited. I'm going to pick them up today. I have my workout that I'm going to do today. Maybe I'll show you guys a little bit of that. That is my day today, you guys. Let's get going. I'm just making myself a coffee. The favorite time of my day is coffee time. And I'm gonna head down to my office because we have giveaways to do today to the Shred 1.0 challenge starting January. So if you have not entered into that, head on over to my Instagram and take your friends, follow me on Instagram and you will be entered in. You'll get access to all the workouts, including the Shred 1.0 challenge meal plans, recipes, plant-based, non-plant-based, access to everything. Me coaching you, an amazing, amazing community. So let's start our 2021 off right and good and healthy. Here's their little, the house. It's got the cookie sign. I'm gonna go get the cookies. I can show you guys the cookies. Oh my gosh, you guys. These cookies, this thing is so heavy. So they're called cookies with a K. Just got a little message. I'll show you guys when I get home. They look like, but this is heavy. These cookies are humongous and they sell out instantly. Cute little card. And then this one's an eggnog one. Yeah, that one's ginger snap or something. This is an eggnog one. So inside they're full of stuff. That's why they're so heavy. So I'm so excited to try these. Cookies, cookies, cookies. Let's see that little face. Hey guys, today's workout is a circuit. It's a little preview for from my Shred 1.0 challenge that is coming out uh, for January 4th. So if you want more information, everything will be in the show. I'm gonna take you through. I'll put everything in the description so you know what to do. All right, so the first one I'm doing here is a standard plated abduction. But again, if you don't have a weighted plate, you can use um, a booty band for this as well. Um, I like to slightly bend my knees and really squeeze at the top. And once I'm done this side, you're gonna wanna go and do the other side. So I go anywhere from 15 up to 30 reps. It just depends on um, what you're doing in the workout. But the higher reps, the better. You get more of a booty, a booty burn that way. All right, and then I'm going into a banded dumbbell frog pump with my shoulders elevated. Um, now, if you're doing these at home, you don't have a dumbbell, you can just use a band or you can even use body weight. You really wanna squeeze your glutes at the top, really bring them to full extension. Keep that chin tucked, looking forward the whole time. And again, I did 15 to 30 reps of these. And this next one we're doing is a Bulgarian split squat. Again, to modify it or just do it at home. You don't have to hold dumbbells. You can have your toe on top of the bench or you can lay your foot flat. It's honestly preference. Remember, it's a split squat, not a lunge. So when you go down, you wanna push your hips back, um, squeezing the glutes and keeping all that weight in your front heel. You can do anywhere from eight to 15 reps per leg, just depending if you have weight or no weight and your uh, fitness level. So the next ones that we're doing are lateral squatted band walks. You wanna make sure the band is just slightly above your knee um, with constant tension on that band. So you don't wanna let your feet come fully together. Keep kind of a distance between them and do about 30 to 40 total. So 15 to 20 each side. These next ones are banded squat pulses. You wanna make sure you drive your hips back, all that weight in your heels and you're gonna do about 15 to 30 of these. This next one, we are doing donkey, ankle weighted donkey kicks. So again, just make sure you keep that spine neutral, squeeze your glutes at the top. Try not to over arch that lower back. Um, and then we're gonna superset this with a fire hydrant um, 
with a fire hydrant kick out combo. So you're gonna do a fire hydrant kick out and bring your knee back in with those ankle weights. And you're gonna do uh, 10 of each to each side. So you'll do all the right side first, then the left side. Last one is just a finisher. So we have four exercises, we're gonna do 25 reps of each. That's it, and that's all. This is gonna finish off your workout. This is going to give you a booty pump. Let's do this. All right, you guys, we're gonna go into a finisher. So we've got four or five exercises. We're gonna start with a banded frog pumps. You're gonna put that band above your knees and you're gonna squeeze your glutes up, pressing your feet together, 25. And then you're going to go into the next one. We're gonna go into banded bridge thrusters. Again, squeeze the glutes at the top, drive the knees away from each other, pushing against that band, 25 of these. No rest between these exercises either. All right, now we're gonna go into bridge fly. So you're gonna hold up into that bridge and you're gonna pulse your knees away from each other. All right, and we're gonna go into standing abductions. So you're gonna stand, drive your hips back, bend your knees and pulse your knees away. 25 of these and then you are done. Now, that last one can totally be done with body weight, okay? You don't have to have a bat. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed that. All right, you guys, I, want, I thought I'm gonna throw in at least one recipe for you guys. Um, since this is just kind of a vlog day, I'm not wearing a bib. I'm mixing, I'm making um, tamari uh, baked chicken. And so I'm using chicken legs. Um, I'll show you guys. This is what I use. It's like a paste. It smells so good. So I put it on the chicken, kind of let it sit for a bit. And then I put it in the oven at about 425 for probably 40 to 60 minutes. I like my drumsticks, like crispy. Um, so we're gonna have that and then probably some white basmati rice and some, some type of veggie. My girls just like cucumber, so I'll probably just do that. But I'll show you the recipe, show you when it's done. So I have to literally run out and get the girls. So I'm gonna throw that chicken on the pan and I've got rice in the rice cooker. I just There is the chicken and I'm gonna put it in the oven and head to get my girls and when I get home, everything's gonna be done. All right, you guys, this is dinner tonight. Uh, the tandoori chicken, jasmine rice, and then for my greens, I just eat um, fried sweet And then the girls will just eat cucumbers and whatever. So that is dinner tonight. What exercise made you feel the most in your glutes? What one was your favorite? Comment below. Give me a like, thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, put requests below. You guys are amazing. Go kill this workout and let me know what you think.